Mm. Okay, so who's in control here? The puppet or the puppeteer? I know where that riddle is. Why did I go in here? There's no riddle in here. Oh yes, I went in here because my brain told me to. Because, oh my god, my subconscious is smarter than I am. Because I had to go in here. I think it says, um, dinosaur? Is it? Dinosaur! Oh my god! Why am I so fucking good? Jesus, man. Right, so this allows us to get through here. Um, mm, Let's just go through here real quick. Boom! Right, I guess this is just quick fire batarang. Boom, boom, boom. Easy peasy. Wow. I think that's like the 57th time I said that. I gotta like come up with something else. Right, before we go through here, I just like to say jump scare warning, okay? Here we go. Very scary, right? Now, we can actually go through this wall here and get another trophy, but of course, there are some goonies down here, and that's never good. This guy here, it's armored. Which, uh, I'll let Batman talk about that, actually. He's wearing body armor. I'll need to unleash a series of quick, focused attacks to penetrate his defenses. And penetrate him I will. Go to hell! I said- Now, circle, square, 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 is of course the beatdown, which, guess what? I've already been doing this entire game. Look out, it's Batman! Now, these thugs here, of course, you can do the beatdown, and it will give you a huge combo bonus. Look at that! Jesus Christ! I've hit him like 50 times, and then you nut him in the face, of course. Of course, Batman nuts a guy with a fucking helmet on. What a legend. You're safe for now. Thank God. You may want to hold off on thanking him until after you've answered my question. Who are you? Sorry, man. I'm a cop. Gordon sent us in here. I'm from the 13th Precinct, part of the strike team. Been in here since the beginning. If Gordon sent you, you'll know the code. Oh yeah, yeah, he said, uh... Oh man, what was it? The code. Now. It's Sarah. He said to tell you the code is Sarah. You're safe, officer. It's Jones, Batman. Elvis Jones. Gordon always said he planned on sending your team in. Yeah, he wanted to know what was going on in here. I guess we found out. There were ten of us. Hopefully, there still are. I told Gordon it was too dangerous to send you in. Stay here. If the rest of your team is alive, I'll find them. Well, I'll try anyway. Now, there are a few Riddler things around here. Of course, this one here is the puppet slash puppeteer thing. Um, I got it. Yes, there we go. Okay, so missing GCPD officers, um, I would read them all out, but of course, like I say, you can read, I'm sure you can. Now, they're all over the place, but I know where they are, let's go find them. So, Scarface, um, I'm not exactly sure what this is from. Like I say, I I'm not really too well versed in the whole Batman universe, unfortunately, um, but I do know this is great up here, oh yeah. Um, but like I say, if you guys know anything that I don't, which you probably will, if you're watching Batman um, Let's Plays on the internet, you probably know quite a bit about Batman. Or nothing at all. So it's, it's either one of those things. You, unless you're like me, in which case, you're quite... Oh, shit. Can I... No, no, I can't do this one just yet. We need the... Um, I, I'm not going to ruin it because I don't really want to ruin, like, all the things you can unlock. Because if you've never played this game, if it's sort of like your first time watching, then I don't really want to be saying, oh, yeah, this is when we get this and this is when we meet this guy. It's like, I kind of want you to experience that for yourself, but, uh, you know, I want to talk about it. In here, um, someone will be. And, uh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. How can someone be in- uh, Wait, wait, that makes no sense. Unless it's like... Hmm. Uh, you'll see it later on, you'll see. Unless they don't come out of there. No, they must do. They No, they do. They come out of here. Whatever, I'm not going to talk about it just yet. We'll see when we come out of the museum. The museum is a very, very big place. It does take quite a long time to get through. Um, I think we need an upgraded, um, what's it called? Cryptographic sequencer. We do need an upgraded one of these to get through here, I believe. Because, um... This uh, this little great thing will come up and we can't get through, which is weird because the the bars are actually quite thin, um, and and the gaps between them are quite large. So I'd have thought that Batclaw could get through, but you know that's beside the point. I'm sure. Um, I believe we do need the line launcher to get through there, which will allow us to get. Oh, oh, do we? Yes, we do. I think. Um, yes, I'm sure we do. I could use a remote controlled batarang to trigger switches that are out of reach. Thank you, Batman. Right, of course, we're going to use the remote control batarang, just like he said. And, of course, we can hit the switch. Boom! And then the door will come up. Or the gate. Whatever you want to call it. Gate. Is it gate? 
door, whatever. I mean, whatever. Okay, so this is the penguin and his family. That is also a Riddler secret. There we go. Was he framed or does he just run in the family? <gasps> I'm not exactly sure. I don't really know which um, which uh, penguin background to believe here. Because, of course, I, I think... Was it Joel Schumacher who, um, who did the movie with the penguin in? Was it like Batman Returns or something? I don't exactly remember. I haven't seen those movies in a very long time. I wouldn't do that if I was you. Show them what we got. So, Batman, you here for the cops, the Iceman, or me? <laughs> I was only here for Freeze and the hostages, but now I'm taking you down too. Ooh. Aren't you scary? <laughs> You're about to find out. Am I really? Listen, I'm what you might call a collector. If someone wants it, all I'd think I've got it. And if I don't have it, <laughs> I'll get it. So here's the thing. Back there, I've got a cabinet with your name on it, just waiting to be filled. And, as luck would have it, here you are, standing just where I want you. <laughs> so, what do you think? Are you going to be a good boy and give up nicely? You're not giving orders here anymore, Cobblepot. I was hoping you'd say that. Look around you. This horrible bunch of psychopaths are all begging to join up with me. But unfortunately for them, I only take the best. And today, best means whoever can kill you. Come on out, lads. It's initiation time. All right then, so now we have to fight like a gajillion people all at once, which um, is good practice, I'm sure. And this is a oh shit, this is a good way to actually get the free flow combo, um, which uh, free flow the free flow combo 2.0. Jesus, that's hard to say. Um, what the hell happened there? I don't think I pressed triangle. Um, I guess I just stopped attacking. Great. Now, of course, I am completely fucking everything up here. Wow. I am very good at this game, by the way. I have to say, I'm magnificent at this game. You should probably take every tip you can from me, because, of course, I'm fantastic. Right. Let's just try not to fuck up. If I stop talking, I'll probably perform um, better than I'm performing now. That's all I'm going to say. I say that and I'm completely fucking up. I'm probably going to die here. Um, that was terrible. You know, if you want to be quite tactical about this, you could just kill yourself, and um, that will allow you to get full health. So, that's a good tactic for you there. Suicide is always the answer. That's a joke. Don't fucking do that. Ah, too much playing those Riddler challenge maps. You weren't supposed to do that, Batman. You're forcing me to bring out the big guns. Oh, 
doesn't look happy to see you, Batman. Good luck. All right, well, as scary as these guys are, they're actually very easy to take down. All you gotta do is jump over them like that, and then it keeps smacking circle, ultra stun, and then keep pressing square. Very, very easy. And of course, the Titans do have their own special moves. Of course, you can slam the ground, you can charge, and uh, you can ride them around like this. Um, unfortunately, the moves are pretty bad, so I'd only suggest uh, using them to ride around on. What are you do, bad? I think these guys actually take three rides and then they die. I, no, they don't die, do they? They get knocked out. So I think they take three rides and then they're knocked out. I'd suggest taking them on first because they can really screw up your game if you don't take them out early on. Although, if you want to take them out last, you can get a huge combo if you don't mess things up. Okay, it would seem that I'm doing fairly well now, which is good. I think uh, not talking whilst I'm fighting large groups uh, was probably the best idea because then I can actually focus more on fighting people and less on giving you commentary. I'm sure you're like already figuring out what to do now. Um, I do like the whole like beatdown thing like this. Beating people down makes things much easier for me and of course you can get a, a rack up a big combo and then you can take people down. It's much easier that way. Let's level up, shall we? Um, anything good? Uh, Bat Swarm. Uh, we might need that at some point, but I don't think we're going to use that for now. Unfortunately, Predator would be good. I keep going over the Catwoman, and I don't really want to upgrade Catwoman just yet. You know what? Let's upgrade the combat armor. There are actually quite a few fights like that around this game, so we probably do want that. I found Penguin. And Mr. Freeze. Have you located the cure yet? Not yet. The situation is worse than I thought. Penguin has a supply of the Titan formula. He's got what? How do you get Titan off Arkham Island? What's going on here? Your suit's bio readings are spiking. Nice of you to join us, Oracle. Alfred, bring Barbara up to speed. Of course. But... I'll be in touch. Okay, so that's Oracle. And, um, I'm not exactly sure who Oracle is. Um, <laughs> like I say, I, I don't really know which continuity this is following. And like I've mentioned, um... Am I doing this right? Did I need to go through that? Um, I don't think I was meant to do it that way. Um, you know, I think we can actually get these Riddler trophies here. Uh, let, let's try it, shall we? Let's try it. If I'm good enough, I could probably do it. Um, I think there's two through here. Let's try it, shall we? If I'm, if I'm, if I'm fucking awesome, I can probably make this. Oh yeah, I'm fucking awesome. It'd be funny if I missed that. Right, so that unlocks that there, which of course we can uh, slide underneath, and then, um, you know what? Let, let's let's just do this real quick. Go under here, we can get this, and uh, through here, this is uh, some glass. Oh my god, let's break the glass real quick. And then over here is the other Riddler trophy. And of course, um, this here, we can actually use the wreck. You don't need to do what some people do, and that is, of course, bring the Batarang all the way around. <laughs> I don't know why people do that. You can just like go through the freaking thing, you know, go through the doorway or the window, I should say, and then use the wreck. Why not? People sometimes go all the way around with a freaking remote control batarang to try and get that. So silly. Right. So now, hmm, did I turn? Did I turn the electricity off? No, I didn't. Okay. Don't go up there then. <laughs> I think you've turned the electricity off with the um the cryptographic sequencer up there, which uh. There's not really much need for that, so uh, yeah, let's unlock this place then, shall we? I don't think I locked on. Did I lock on? Um, I did not. Wow. I am a silly goose. There we go. Let's try again. Um, I'm not exactly sure what this one is. Let's have a look, shall we? Jurassic, perhaps? Yeah, oh, oh, yeah, oh, oh, oh. There we go. Jurassic. Fantastic. Now we can go up here. Hmm. I'm smelling Riddler. All right, let's bring this up. And uh, I believe we can go through here now. Yes! Oh my god. You see, this is what you get when you play this game so much. You kind of remember where all the really like strange and obscure things are. 
Now we can bring this back down. Boom. And now we can climb on top. And if you're another burp, I probably should like stop drinking what I'm drinking. <gasps> Pardon me. Whew. It's actually some, um, it's like a instant cappuccino thing, which I, I really enjoy though. It's really flavorful. And I also have some instant mochas as well. Mocha, mocha, whatever you want to call it. My mom calls it a mocha, which sounds weird to me. I call it mocha. Mocha latte, as some people would say. Um, anyway, that's beside the point. Why am I talking about coffees? Anyway, boom. What the fuck? Here, Batman. Batman. Hello, Bruce. Can you fucking... There we go. Finally. Don't know what he was doing there. Right, so we can go through here now, and this will lead us into the place which is flooded, which is a very, very interesting place. That's all I'm going to say. Stay where I can see you, Batman. You wouldn't believe the fight the old snowman put up. Still, I got what I wanted. That's all that matters. <laughs> Hold still, boy. <laughs> When you're done in here, feel free to join me in the Iceberg Lounge so I can kick your ass again. Enjoy the Copsicle. Over here, please. Uh, penguin, talk about your cold shoulder. Please. The ice looks unstable. I need to move slowly. Take my time. Well, it would seem that we're on thin ice. Please. Chill. I'm on my way. Allow me to break the ice. Hold on. You should be safe here. Th thank you. Are you from the 13th Precinct? Where's the rest of your team? There are two more guys in this room. Penguin froze them up, then went after me. I ran and... Well, I guess you saw what happened. I'll get them. You wait here and try to warm up. I'm kind of running out of ice puns here. <laughs> um, I'll try and think of some more though, of course, because, like I say, my first introduction to Mr. Freeze was um, in the Batman and Robin movie, in which case he was just pulling those one-liners all the time, the little puns about ice and shit. HOLY SHIT, THERE'S A FUCKING SHARK IN HERE! Sorry, Batman. Did I forget to mention my little friend down there? Me, Tiny. Who'd have thought a big fish could be so useful? Not me, that's for sure. He's like a mobile garbage truck. Whatever I drop in that tank just vanishes. Poof. <laughs> Problem gone. Just like that. Poof. Problem gone. Right, so we need to pull this down and bring it over to us, and we can save that guy over there to the left. Um, I, I need to think of some more ice puns, man. I mean, the ice puns are just fantastic. Right, let's climb onto this. Now, my biggest fear... Uh, well, probably one of my biggest fears in the entire world, fuck me, this is so scary, right, is looking down into an open area of water, not being able to see down into it, but knowing there's something in there. That is so fucking scary. Could you imagine, you're on a boat, let's say, a little dinghy, let's say as well, and you're looking down, but you look around, and there's a fucking fin come up, and then it disappears. And that is it. You're looking down, and you can't see shit. That Oh my god, it makes me feel ill on the inside. I don't even know how to explain that. The movie, what was it called? Open, open water was it called? Where they were stuck in the, um, the open water and there was sharks around them and it was a tr based on a true story. Uh, oh, that, that was a scary movie for me because I was shitting myself. Once again, allow me to break the ice. Now we can take this guy back to safety, and we can get his friend. Cold. Where did 
Penguin get that gun? He stole it from Mr. Freeze. I'm getting it back. Alright, so now we have to go over through here, and this... Oh, I'm smelling a penguin. Ah, oh, where are you? There you are. My lord. Now, I'm also smelling another Riddler trophy. This is how you get this one. You do a REC quickfire, and then you slide. I think you do anyway. Um, oh yes, you do. And then, you have to try and get this at the right time. Ah, oh, ah, oh, third time's a charm though, right? Ah, oh, no, fourth time's a charm though. I got it, which it said it said I didn't, because the thing went over to the left. Uh, yeah, so I'm not exactly sure how I got that one, but whatever. Don't tell anyone. I think I might be cheating. Right, so um, we go through here now, and this is where we use predator mode once again. <laughs> 